What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, uh, we are heading down to the paint shop. Hopefully this M3, uh, I mean not M3, this M4 repainted the front end and uh, getting it ready. Because once it's ready for that, we're going to be heading over to CHP. So uh, we're dropping it off today, picking it up, same video hopefully, and getting it down to CHP and getting everything we done, we need done on this car. We need this car to be perfected before we take it out to LA. Um, because you know, we're doing the crank hub, so it's a long job. And uh, there's no better place than SSR Performance to do the job. So we need to get make sure the car is ready. All right, guys. So I got the wifey. She's driving the IA behind me. She's actually with her sister. We're going to be taking this car down to the paint shop. And then we got a little appointment ourselves that we got to take care of. So uh, any hoozles, let's go ahead and get down to the paint shop, drop off the car. I'll let you guys know the next plan. But hopefully in the, like, the next part, should it should just be us picking up the car because we really need the car back by Wednesday. <laughs> Just dropped off the car with Antonio. Hopefully the front end's gonna be absolutely perfect this time, but uh, I, I guess we'll get back to him in probably about a day or two. And this is the next day. So uh, yeah, I'm always trying to get these days all in one video because pick it up and drop it off the car uh, it's kind of important to see it. So you guys know when we dropped off the car, it was actually perfectly done other than the fact that the P he basically put Bondo and paint over the PDC sensors. So we're gonna go ahead and hopefully pick it up today and he got that fixed up. And then after that, um, we're gonna be coming back home for a little bit and then we're heading off to get some clear bra on the front end because we're, we're taking this car down to LA to get the crank hub done like you guys know. So on the way over there, I don't want a whole bunch of new rock chips on the hood, bumper, and fenders. So we're gonna go ahead and clear bra the whole front end with Junior. I don't know if you guys know Junior, he's the one that helped me wrap my 435, my 650. Yeah, really good guy. I love this dude. They also do tents and clear brawing. So I'm gonna be heading over to him hopefully later today and getting that done. Without further ado, let's take the i8 out and go get the M4. Guys, just arrived. Let's check out the M4. Bada bang, bada. Nothing's been done to the front end. I mean, the rear end. Here's the front end. Um, yes. So we can finally see the sensors there. Oh, that looks a little weird though. I don't know how I feel about that. All right, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and find Antonio and just talk to him real quick. So I'll come back to you guys in a little bit. All right, guys. We got the M4 behind us. Let's head home real quick and uh, call up CHP and call up the wrap shop. We're gonna hopefully get this thing fully legally registered and hopefully also get that clear bra on there. I also have the BMW emblem, so uh, that front end should be looking pretty good. home the i8 back in the garage and the m4 is finally here and we got some chipotle <laughs> so yeah it's already now me and my brother are addicted to chipotle we're about to munch down did you get anything special today or just the, the um, typical got, chipotle uh, mole? you get the you know the cup and you put the little chipotle sauce okay in. okay so that's what you gotta do you gotta get the tortilla get on the side uh-huh so you gotta make your own little sandwich <laughs> okay and that's the best part <laughs> but why why do you get the sandwich on the side dude like why would you do that why don't you just get okay, the okay, burrito right, in the first so, place? So, so you, you gotta listen. You get the bowl, uh huh, and then you get the burrito. Okay. Oh my God, it's so ingenious, man. So we're gonna go <laughs> and enjoy our Chipotle, and then hopefully we're gonna be trying to head off and get the front end clear brought, and then actually I have a DMV appointment as well. I just set one up, and hopefully we can go over there and uh, get VIN verification done. If we can get VIN verification done, we can also get plates probably tomorrow. So that would I would try to include that in the same video if we can. I'm try again. I, I wanna I wanna put as much content as I possibly can in one video. So it's not like one day registering, one day getting plates. That's ridiculous. So after that, uh, you guys will see me and my brother a little bit fatter in a little bit. All right, guys, your man officially gained about 15.2 pounds, um, but it's finally time to get the M4 clear bar. It is a little dirty, but as you guys know with clear bar, you do have to spray paint the entire, like you do have to spray the entire bumper and then clear bra it. So we should be good. Um, oh, luckily I didn't forget the emblem. We have the emblem. It did come in. Your man went with an OEM BMW emblem. It's definitely going to help bring the whole car together, especially when it's all clear bra new emblem it's gonna look so good so let's head down to rc restyling and hopefully hopefully um everything will go according to plan for those of you guys who wanted to hear a startup definitely a lot louder than any other car this car is warmed up you guys obviously know we just drove it back so uh it's pretty much warmed up it's 
sounds good, boys. Bro. Today is Junior's birthday, and he's helping me work on the car. I mean, shout out to him. This cop has been tailing me for a little bit now. I'm really hoping my temporary plates are good because if we're not, we're gonna get pulled over, boys. Oh man, I'm stressed out. My hands actually shaking. I, I, I honestly don't have time for this. It's Junior's birthday. I just want to make it down to his place right now. All right, we're, we're good, boys. Oh my God, he went around me. I think he realized it's like, oh, he's good, he's good. All right, these plates, these plates, check out. <laughs> Oh my god. When the wolf takes you guys to the pack, <laughs> look at this is like a police station of me. I didn't even know that. <laughs> so many police. I want to say police because oh my lord. For some reason, I don't know why, but every time I see a cop, and no matter what car I'm in, <laughs> I always feel like they're after me. Like who else feels like that? Leave me a comment down below. When you're driving any car, especially when I head over to my, my mom's car and then I realize I'm like, oh wait, I'm in my mom's car. I'm good. Um, but I always feel like, you know, like I'm doing something wrong. Wrong. It's just so weird. If you guys know what I mean, make sure to comment down below. We are just arriving now to Junior's place. Uh, so yeah, let's say what's up. My God, an E30 M3. And I think this is a 2002. I think so. Not sure. Actually, this is a four door. I don't know if it's a 2002, but that is gorgeous. I love the E30 M3. One day, guys, one day. Anywho, here is Junior's place. <laughs> if you guys want any tinning, ceramic, I mean, I think they do summer cutting as well. Clear browning, wrapping, anything at all, make sure to check out RC Restyling. I'm gonna have the links down below. Again, huge special shout out to Junior. That's actually his Civic. We actually seen it transform so much. We ran into him the other day on the highway and I barely even recognized him. Uh, but anywho. So we're finally inside with Junior and uh, first off, hold up, hold up. First off, um, you're now officially a YouTuber. Yes, I am. <laughs> Look what he has in his hand. I had to join, you know, I had to join the squad. The G7X game. <laughs> So you had this other camera that I wasn't like, when you hold a giant DSLR, it's just really inconvenient, especially if you're just trying to go from one place to another, you're trying to go inside of a store and out. Um, a GCMX just makes your life a whole lot easier. And uh, but anyway, we're not talking about that right now. We're talking about today is Junior's birthday and he's working on my car. So <laughs> huge shout out to him. I mean, honestly, I, you should have told me like, what the heck are we playing this like? To be honest. You uh, forgot? So to be honest, I kind of forgot it was my birthday. So when I was like, Oh shoot, I told him Wednesday, Wednesday's my birthday, but <laughs> oh, it happens, I mean, okay. we gotta do work, we gotta do work, you know? I appreciate you, my G. <laughs> so yeah, we are officially here with the M4. Uh, when we took it down to the shop, what they did was instead of repainting the bumper, they basically just drilled out the holes, and to be honest with you, I'm not really too happy with that. But, I mean, it is what it is. When you put clear bra and wrap over it, it's gonna look perfectly fine. Uh, but honestly, I just wish they did it right the first time. Other than that, they did delete these, which are great, and um, they did paint those. So, anywho, the clear bra that you have is custom cut out other than the hood, right? Yes. So, we, I... So pretty much the way that the clear bra, usually you can get a kit for it, but I was looking for a kit for the GTS hood, and the program that we were using just didn't have it. So we're yeah. gonna end up just doing a hand cut, which isn't too bad. Luckily we have everything else, so we just line it up and should be able to knock it out. Cool, cool. So uh, this is my first time. I'm just, I, I honestly can't wait to see how it works because tints, I've tried it. I, I'm really bad at it. I, I like I saw Junior just do a Tesla in front of me like it was nothing. For me, for some reason, I cannot do tint. Wrap is another topic. Doesn't look like paint. He can make it look like paint. Clear bra, I heard, is a whole nother level. This is the video as well. Yeah. This is a learning. This is not your like your brother normally takes care yeah, of this my stuff, right? Is a professional when it comes to clear bra. <laughs> So for me, I just like was like, sure, let's do it. We'll get the pattern. We'll try it ourselves. Because so. I want to just, I want to have fun doing it. Like it's, I, I don't care if it's 100 percent perfect. I just want to learn. I want to just like just go at it myself. You know, I don't want to just keep taking the car to the shop. I ain't balling like that at the same time. I kind of want to also learn how to do it. So uh, without further ado, we're both gonna try to attempt this, and hopefully it ends up being good, right? We'll be able to.
Mr. Humble over here saying that he doesn't, he's not helping out on the car. Hey, it's because I haven't been doing anything, but I'm gonna go ahead and help you. <laughs> we'll go ahead and try this. Yeah, this one should have the, the line to where it's like you don't have to like tuck it under. Should just line up perfectly. It was so much easier than a bumper. Hey, that do it? Yep, it's good to go. Yeah, we just gotta wait for this edge and then we'll tuck it in. All right, guys, so my boy Junior gave me an organic drink to try. <laughs> Do you think people know what this is? Yeah? yeah? I think a lot of people think. I've actually never heard of this. Okay, so this has caffeine? Yes, but personally, I think it has like a, it doesn't have that weird crash that like most like monsters or Okay, like that's actually, like, oh, this is an energy drink. It's, it's, it has caffeine, but it's not like. <laughs> you guys about to see me knock this thing out. <laughs> okay, let me try this here real quick. Alright guys, so shout out to Junior. We have the new emblem on there, the OEM BMW emblem. It looks so good. I already dirtied it up a little bit. I might need to clean that up. But anywho, it's looking so good. The M4 is officially fully clear rod in the front bumper. We have the hood partially clear rod up here. We actually had to do custom cutting for this. It came out perfect. And even the fenders, we got a little bit of clear rod here. I don't know if you guys can see that. But um, super, super, super happy. Got the whole front end clear rod and uh, the whole front end also painted, paint matched and all that good stuff. Again, huge special shout out to G. It's his birthday and he's staying extra late. So I appreciate you, my dude. The only issue is that we had was with the sensors down here and that is not our fault. That is again, the body shop. I love Antonio. I love everything he's done for me so far other than this bumper. This bumper, I, I, he just, I'm not even gonna go over it. I'm not happy with that. We might have to see to take that back, but I really don't wanna take it back a third time. We finally got the car back. I already clear brought it. So it, it might be, it is what it is. We might just get a new bumper down the road. But as for now, it is what it is. I'm happy, the car is looking good, and it's been a long day, so. Uh, that guy, I need your guys' support. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? So, it, no, um, all I was gonna say is just, if you guys please, go subscribe to my channel. If you guys are into Honda. Hell yeah, well, actually, it's not just that, like you also do rapping and a bunch of. Rapping, shoot, I do installs too, I like, not just like videos like this, but I also yeah. do like installs on my car. So if you guys ever just wanna check out a different kind of build. There you guys have it. And also, like you said, we're in, like this is his business, like tinning cars, wrapping cars, and then Starting out clear brawing, right? Like this is this is both of our pretty much our first time, and it came out great. Um, at least in my opinion, I'm really happy with it. So yeah, if you guys want to see also how to tint and do a bunch of stuff, your channel. Yep. If you guys do want to subscribe to my channel, it's just Junior. So the whole word. It's gonna be linked down below, bro. Don't worry about it. Down. It's gonna be linked. <laughs> so if you guys ever just are interested, like I said, in a different kind of build, I have my Civic Si that I have almost full bolt on. And you know, maybe later in the future, we're gonna have to race with one of newer cars. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> it's a 2020, he's also gonna be picking up a rebuild possibly, right? Yeah. So, might be picking up a rebuild on his channel. He wants to experience it for the first time. I know a lot of you guys haven't done rebuilds as well, so if you guys wanna see a guy firsthand, you're not a mechanic either, right? Nope, so this is gonna be a, a new experience. Newer's giving, giving me that confidence to go ahead and <laughs> So, you never know guys so you might learn a thing or two so make sure to check out his channel down below and without further ado guys that's going to conclude today's video it's been a long day and uh again huge shout out to junior for spending the day with me on his birthday um he's gonna go spend it with his girl now she's probably super angry with me <laughs> but without further ado, guys i love y'all so much cop some merch if you haven't i'll see you guys in the next one and uh, don't forget to stay humble peace out